Hello everyone, it's Hannah here and it's our uh, Pick My Brain session. So today's question was, uh, do I have to register VAT? So that's actually a really good question and lots of startup companies, they do ask about it. So uh, not all companies um, are required to register VAT or some uh, businesses perhaps not, may not be allowed to register VAT. Things like, um, say, if you are the doctor surgery and you, if you provide a healthcare service, that is primarily for restoring human health. Because government wants uh, to have this kind of service affordable for people. So this, if you are providing this, then uh, you don't have to register VAT at all. But for most of types of uh, product or service, you might need to look into VAT. So currently the threshold is 85k uh, for any rolling 12 months. Above the threshold, you have to register VAT. But under this, you, you can choose to register or not. So there are some benefits, uh, especially uh, for startup companies to register VAT. Say you have a lot of purchases, uh, you've been charged VAT, but then you have no sales uh, at the moment. So by registering that, you are able to claim the VAT you paid on the purchases, so it can aid your cash flow. And the other side is uh, you, can, you can pretend yourself to be big, uh, because when people seeing your service uh, has VAT on it, they might think, yeah, your company might be big. But then if there's no VAT on your invoice, then they would, they, they would know that you are earning under the threshold. Or for um, some people, they might want to be safe because if you are say if you're earning about like 75K at the moment, you're worried that you might go up the threshold very soon. So uh, it might be the case that it's safe to register. But the downside is every quarter you have to file the VAT return and it can be more admin burden. So it's really, um, I think this is, is a sort of a general guidance out there. And then just for you to decide, for you to evaluate if that's, if your business, A, if um, your service um, need to register VAT, and B, if that's beneficial for you to register VAT. Okay, so I hope you find this one useful. Of course, VAT is a very big topic and there are lots of areas. Uh, we will cover more details in the future uh, Pick My Brain sessions. And if you do have any questions uh, specifically on this, feel free to uh, personal message me. And also, I'm also on Facebook and we have a private Facebook group called Tax Deductible Lifestyle Tribe, where you can connect with me, connect with our panel of experts, like financial experts, uh, as well as uh, get support from other people. Okay, so I hope you have a very wonderful evening and I shall see you very soon. Bye now.